first step is to decide on a shape of your brow. If one eyebrow is more angular and the other one is more round, decide which one you like best so you can mimic it on the other side. Then you want to make sure that you have a taupe eyeshadow. Taupe is universally flattering on any eyebrow color and an eyeshadow is more flattering because it looks softer than an eyebrow pencil. And using your eyebrow comb, brush your eyebrow down. This sounds weird and it looks weird too. But what this is going to help you do is create a really defined line at the top of your eyebrow. All right, so you've combed your eyebrows down, then using your brush, hold it at the outer corner of your nose and see where it lines up with the outer corner of your eye. This is where your eyebrow should naturally end. If it's not that long, you want to make a dot using your shadow and then load up your brush. And you're going to start outlining the top of your brow first and foremost because when you do that, it creates a nice line so when you fill it in later, it won't get too big. Start with a thicker corner and in short strokes, move outward, go along your arch. I have a sparse area, so I'm going to fill that in and then bring it down. Now that you've outlined the top of your eyebrow, use your comb and brush them upward. This is when we're going to start filling in the actual brow. Then load up your brush again with more taupe shadow and go in short upward motions starting at the inner part of your brow. I like working my way towards the arch. When you get to your arch, you have to be very careful because if you make it too defined, it can look really cartoonish. It won't look natural at all. So I like to just lightly outline a little bit and go with the growth of the hair because that always looks most natural and then go back and brush upward. And this is the time. If you see sparse areas, load it up with more taupe shadow and go back in. finish things up, take your comb and brush your hairs upward. Then you're going to take it across to make that really perfect outline. Then to finish off your look, use a clear mascara or a brow gel to hold your brows in place. I'm Kirby and we'll see you next time on Pop Sugar Beauty.